Hello and welcome to another Let's Play Lotro with me, Balfellian. So today we're going to resume questing around Foreign Had in the Troll Shores with Tristana. And she's just getting her feet warm. So if we activate the UI, so what have we got to do today? We need to scout the Troll Cave, which could be quite interesting if the trolls are uh, quite high morale. Let's bounce up. Uh, we need to defeat some bears to the north. I'm not sure if we're going to head over that way yet. Um, I need to track some wolves. Ooh. I'm guessing the, the quest to kill the deer was a daily then. If we've got this one popping again. Culling the prey, yeah, is a repeatable. So I'll probably pick that up as I go along. Um Okay, so we're heading southeast of Thornhead, just to the bottom of this mountain range over here, north of the Breen and Gorges on the map. And there is going to be a cave. There's also going to be a hell of a lot more bears with repeatable quests. And a wolf has decided to attack me as well. I think what I'll do then is I'll quickly mop up these repeatable quests and I will meet you guys by the cave. Okay, so we're back then. We're now at the Troll Cave, just a little bit further east of uh, Foreign Had, and I've actually dinged as well while doing all these daily repeatables because it turns out that pretty much all of the creatures we've killed in the recent videos, so uh, bears, hawks, deers, crawlers, they're all repeatable quests so it's great if you, you know, if you're a bit of a slow leveller you'll get quite a few of those done and quite a bit of XP. But uh, let's go in the troll cave then, so how big are these trolls? 7k! This is going to be interesting. Okay. What do I need to do in the troll cave to scout it? Nobody knows. Well, I probably don't want to be fighting more than one of these at a time. This is definitely the right troll cave, isn't it? So, this could be interesting. how deep you have to go. We don't want to fight two of them. Two of them will be taking the mickey. That's it. Come back over here. Right. I'm going to pull out some extra stops for this fight then. So, careful step. If you're quick... Oh, you're not going to get in stealth in time. Damn it. I was going to try and go in stealth and then uh, knock him down but that failed horribly. Okay, this guy actually does a fair bit of damage. Who would have guessed it? Come on, get unstunned. You don't have time to be stunned. It's quite a slow work, but I think we've got this in hand. We're technically technically losing. He's got more percentage morale than we do at the minute, but myself is a ticket away, so let's go back up. That said, he's now chunking me a bit. Right, we're just rotating onto pure self heal spam now. Okay, now I'm slightly worried. Oh crap. Javelins. Beat your cunning retreat around the corner. Press buttons. There we go. Damn, that guy was a bit tough. Right. Now we've got another one. Lovely. Um, I'm already eating a bit of food, which is going to be some Maya. I don't have any regen food in my bags, though, which is a bit of a shame. Because I could do with that to uh, get back in combat a bit quicker. Should probably regen up to full health. Well, to be fair, we could just sneak past him. If he discovers me in stealth, we're in massive trouble. There we go, careful step. Sneak past him, please don't see me, I'm a tiny hobbit. Thank you. Oh shit! He knows they're saying trying to sneak past him. 
didn't quite see me though. Well, the problem is, this is going to time out right next to the troll. We we'll have to fight this one. Bang. There we go. Knocked him down to the floor so we can get a bit of a head start on him. Chunked him by about 700 morale. I'll take that. Chuck a few javelins in his face. Get some bleeds going. This one's hurting quite a bit. Get the self heals up. Don't be stunned. I'll just self heal. Four icon self heal. Onslaught. Power attack. Should probably use my, my fast gambit builders. I should do some of these faster, I'm just being lazy. Okay, safeguard. Yeah, we've got this one well under control. Go on. Go on. There we go. Right. This will probably be the point where we get to the back of the cave and it's like three in one go or something stupid. Is this one technically meant to be a fellowship? It's not. They just asked me to scout the entrance of the troll cave. I've scouted the entrance and then some, and nothing has happened. Which is a bit worrying. <clears throat> Especially since I can't careful step past this next guy. How long does that one cool down? 50 seconds? Ah. I think I might cut away and meet you guys when I'm a bit deeper in this cave, because this is going to take a while. Well, it's gone horribly wrong, and I've just tried making a dash for the uh, the deep part of the cave to see if anything's going to happen. And the answer is, no, it's not. So what have I done wrong on this quest? Was I meant to literally just scout the entrance and not even go in the cave? Oh, hang on, there's an upstairs. Yep, yeah, let's go an extra man. Because fuck it, why not? Oh, one of them's actually reset, which which might help. Apart from the fact he's hitting me for 500 damage. That's just rude. If you take another hit, you're dead, girl. Oh no, not the stun. No. Oh, that might have helped. Cheers. Even though they run faster than me. Oh, and you're dead. There we go. Um. I'm not really sure whether reviving for free is the wisest course of option. We're only halfway out of the cave, so I think I will retreat. Which is going to take us literally just opposite four and had then. So, trolls in the shores is definitely go to the cave we were just in. So, why did that not advance? That is a good question. Let's get some wood. Bound top. How far is it? Not too far. So if we just dodge past this bear. There we go. So this is the cave literally just over here. It's not too far from Foreign Hat at all. Now, have I been stupid and I did not need to go inside the cave itself? Do I need to have a look at the bird? It's the bird! There's an evil spying bird, and all I had to do was walk up to it and kill it. Isn't that a bit easier than fighting 7k trolls? There we go. Oh no, quest available into the cave. Now I need to go inside. Oh god. I didn't go too well last time. It's still not marked as a fellowship quest though. Is it literally just go inside the cave and go, oh shit? It is literally go inside the cave and go, oh shit. These cave trolls are far harder than the stone trolls you encountered elsewhere in the troll shores. Well, oh shit, they've got 7k. So, mount up then, and I will meet you guys back at uh, Arod's camp, just uh, on the cliff above the road, so I've had four and had. Okay, so we're back at Arod's camp then. And he's going to say, cave trolls! I've never heard of them coming so far from Moria. 
It's like, well, why'd you call your region the Troll Shores then, you moron? But anyway, he's going to give us a quest to go warn people that there are trolls about. And this person is... On the road to the west. So this is the camp that's uh, halfway between Bracken's camp and the turn off to Forenhad, just over here. Underneath the, uh, the Bee of Green and Gorges. So we're going to cut away again and I will meet you guys there. Okay then, so we just hand that what quest. And they're surprised about the cave trolls as well. So that's going to finish everything we have to do here. So I think if we head back to Forenhad, I've got a couple of those daily repeatables for killing mobs to hand in. So uh, cut away again. Okay, so we're back at Thorin Had then, and um, we've got a quest handed Greetings, or two to take traveler. to this dwarf, just the one. Which is for killing the bears and turning them into blankets. So that pretty much finishes off stuff there. We need to go to the wolf den next, so I'll, I'll probably do that one in the next video. But uh, a couple of points just to touch on from my level up is first off, I got a trait point, so where am I going to spend this? Um. So we can go for extra crit on our bleeds. Uh, the offensive strike gambit line applies an incoming healing debuff to enemies. Probably not too much use for solo, at least now anyway. Um, enhances the morale tap ability of offensive strike. So the ability to steal morale from a target and apply it to yourself. Um, or I can upgrade the spear sweep skill. So spear sweep, which I've already got, grants onslaught red, green, red. The ability to consume the bleed from power attack, which is red, green, yellow, um, to deal AoE damage. Uh, but this extra trait just basically makes it even more effective for that to happen. So let's try going for that one. And the other thing I was going to touch on was at level 35 I've unlocked a brand new skirmish. Which it's not going to highlight whichever one it was, so I can't tell you which one it was. But as you can see, our, our instance panel is, is filling up quite nicely with stuff, and there is a hell of a lot more of those that will gradually unlock on the way to uh, level 100. But uh, that's all for now then, and next episode we will continue with uh, questing in the Troll Shores. So see you guys then.